World Heavyweight Contender, Chris Ariola, my dude. What up, G? What up, G? How's everything, man? <laughs> good, good. Hey, I saw a picture with you and Carl Frampton. Yeah, just right now, earlier, just just earlier this morning, man. Cool ass dude. You a big Already fan of Carl? Drinking, just like me. <laughs> yeah, man. You know what, man? I love the way he fights, man. Uh, him and Leo, they, they gave a fucking great show both times, and you know, looking forward for the third one. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that too. Hopefully that trilogy takes place. So we're here for Mayweather McGregor, another Irishman. What are your thoughts on that fight? Break it down for us. You know what, man? Um, respect Walter McGregor for coming out to the boxing world. I believe, I strongly believe that Mayweather is going to you know, put a clinic in, like he always does. But let's just say the worst happens and McGregor beats him. And, uh, and honestly, it's a slap in the face to boxing. You're right. You know what I mean? Definitely will be. No and, doubt about and it. People, people are just constantly going to be like, hey, yeah, fuck boxing. You know, MMA took over. <laughs> we're the shit. So that's one of the that biggest be things I'm pissed off about. Yeah, exactly. What, what about I Chris? Hope it doesn't happen. What about Chris Ariola crossing over to MMA? Never. Never? Never. <laughs> nah, man. You're a straight they up boxer? They don't pay enough. First of all, they don't pay enough. And the risk, the risk outweighed the rewards. You know, I respect watching. They, 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 they fight and it's a hard sport, but I'll stick to boxing, man. This is what I know, this is what I love. Should we expect you back here in September for Canelo versus Triple G? Absolutely. The I'll actual be here. fight, because I this is an event. September 16th is it's the fight. fight. Yeah, yeah, absolutely, man. And I'm picking, I'm picking Triple G. But I'm telling you, it's not an easy power fight. It's a pick em fight. It's whoever you, whoever you choose, because they're both fucking phenomenal fighters. And you know what? Canelo, man, he's looking tough. He's looking like he's ready. He's looking like he's focused. He's looking like a man on a mission. So I'm looking forward for that fight, man. Hey, what are your thoughts? Did you hear about Oscar De La Hoya taking to his Twitter saying, fuck Mayweather versus McGregor? Because he's not fighting, man. Come on. If he was the one fighting, he'd be like, he'd be out for it. Come <laughs> on. If, Mayweather, if, if De La Hoya was fighting McGregor, he'd be like, hell yeah, he'll be raking in the money. So the fact that he's not in, he's going to be hating. You know, so who gives a fuck? You know, in all honesty, I like Oscar. I like Oscar a lot. I, I do. like Oscar too. I hang out with them, you know, it's a cool dude, but if he was in this shoes, he would have been doing the same damn thing. Hey, do you remember the nickname I gave you? I said Chris F. Bombs Ariola? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hey, when should we expect you back? Uh, but then in November, man. November? Um, yeah, getting back in the gym, getting back into it. It's just hard for me to fuck it from Monday to come. Because Monday comes, I'm like, ah, I guess I'll go next Monday. But uh, Monday's coming, and Monday, uh, Gotta hit the gym, man. All right, Chris, continue with those F-bombs. Have a couple of beers, not too much tomorrow. Exactly. We gotta be back on Monday. All right, my man? All right, brother. All right, I'll see you. Thank you, man. Chris. Pleasure.